today on Uncovered. Don't touch me! Don't touch me! No, no, no! 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 On March 8, 2024, police received a call about two young women fighting outside of their apartment building and causing a disturbance to other residents. When officers arrived to investigate, they weren't expecting things to get this intense so quickly. How you doing, ladies? What, what's actually going on? I got a woman running around the back of building 200 banging on things there's two i think there's two girls there and they're screaming she was screaming get out of my house get out of my house right, let me get take a run let's see what's coming yep. hey miss did you happen to call us there's somebody running around out here i hear him in here seven zero it's gonna be room or correction apartment 210 police department open the door it's the police department the suspect answers the door and gives officers a very rude and entitled tone of voice. The situation goes sour very quickly when she tries. To well, I will say right off the gate, if they knock on your door and you open it, you ain't gonna be able to close it no more. I can tell you that right off the get go. Cause you know, when they open that door and say like it's open right now, you can see in there, if they see something illegal, say a marijuana roach or uh, any kind of uh, weapon or anything that, uh, piques their curiosity she's in for a world of surprise because they're coming on in because one they got called there and two you open the door if you wanted to speak to them you should have spoke to them to the door let's see what happens is to shut the door on the officer's face you don't have Hello. the right to open or search my door so i'm not going to be opening my okay. door what's going on here today okay nothing there was i'm moving out my stuff and i'm cleaning out my stuff okay my sister's are you guys fighting with the sister again or having an argument or something no because we got called for some sort of a disturbance, people. Yeah, yelling. I'm sure it was upstairs, right? No. That was okay, no. wherever it was. Well, okay. they're just. You like how she tried to play it off? It was them upstairs. It wasn't us. We're good down here in 210. <laughs> Slick. Just haters, and they've been stalking me, probably. Okay. And I should call the police on them, but no, me and okay. my sister. Who else, who else is here? My sister, she's staying yeah. here. She does not live here. I live okay. here. I have the lease. Yeah, okay. Me and her are cleaning. We were arguing. We were making a TikTok. Yeah. What, I don't know if you guys are familiar with TikTok. Yeah. What's your first name again? What's your sister's name? Can I talk to you? So they're making TikToks up in a nice little apartment, and the police have been called there due to some type of disturbance. Uh, I can tell you right now, this is not looking good because... Just to be honest with you, she's answering way too many questions. What's your name? What's this? What's that? Open the door. Like, damn, y'all asking me a lot of questions. He who asks the questions is in control of the conversation. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> We're in our bras, respectfully, Hello. but you know. How you doing, miss? Do you mind just stepping out here and talking to uh, Officer Prager? Yeah. Oh, uh, can I go sit here? Go for it. I'm going to shut my door now. No, we're going to leave it open for the time being, okay? Um, no, you don't pay my rent, so I will be... If you try to push... Don't, don't shut me! Don't touch me! Now you're under arrest. 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 Stop. I'm not trying to stop. Just stand over here. 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 Why do people always say, I was recording, I'm recording? Police don't care about that. Just so you know, they're recording as well with the body cams, and they don't care about you recording. Put your hand behind your back. Stop fighting with me. Stop resisting. Stop resisting. I shut the door in your face. Stop. Stop resisting. Stop fighting. Hold up. I have to pause that because that's a lot of screaming. And uh, does it have any effect? If you scream, yell, pull away, act really, really wild, will the police let go? If you act like a wild hyena, will they just say, forget it, I'll give up? Have you ever seen that work before? We're about to find out. Stop resisting. Stop resisting. Stop resisting. Give me your other hand. Also, if you notice the other tactic that the police like to use is to stop resisting, stop resisting, because they want to make sure for the body camera, for any evidence or any witnesses that look, they were resisting the whole time. Even if you're resisting or not, even though we can clearly see she's fully resisting, 
on uh, you know the best she can, but it ain't gonna work. It don't look like. Give me your other hand. No, 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 now she's saying you're a racist you're a racist now if you hurl some uh racial epithets they might let you go just like that this video is even surprising to you give it a thumbs up give it a like give it a share today's sponsor is futurecashflowclub.com and uh these young ladies are definitely going to jail. The one who pushed or pulled the officer's arm at the door and the one who tried to break up the other officer from arresting the other young lady. This is getting wild. While the officers place the suspect's sister under arrest for obstructing justice, the suspect runs away while still in handcuffs. The deputy chases her shortly after. Got a female running towards the main entry. She's handcuffed, white shirt. Purple pants. Me. Stop. No, you're on recording. I'm going to record you. No. Stop, stop, stop. Stop, you're stop. hurting me. Why are you grabbing my hair like that? No, stop touching me. Can I put my hand like, on the floor? Right here. There. Okay. There. Right here. Okay. 1045 is on the way. <laughs> so. so I got a silly question for you. Have you ever seen somebody actually get away while in handcuffs? I mean, I would think if you're going to run, you want to run way before you're actually in cuffs. But once you're in cuffs, what are you going to do? Run, fall on your face? She ran, what, two or three buildings away around the corner. He caught her pretty easily, as you can tell. And this is just crazy. Girls gone wild. That's so bad. You did. <laughs> you did. I'm so mad. I, I, I know it. <laughs> All you had to do was talk to us. I know. I couldn't even get mad because I'm like, this is why I got arrested the first time. Tempor, you need anybody else out there? No. So she says she's been arrested the first time. So she's a repeat offender. You can kind of tell. I guess if you see somebody really, really fighting hard not to go to jail, they've probably been to jail before. I mean, I don't know if anybody who's never been is going to fight this hard to not go. And they still like afraid or something, but a person who's already been or has a rap sheet that knows what those metal bracelets on your hands feel like, you don't like that feeling. They're cold and they don't feel good. They're not made for comfort. <laughs> Stop Stop zero. touching me. Why are you such an asshole? Why are you touching me? You slow me? it down. I got two females no, kind of like. Come on. You're an asshole. Leave me the. Are you anybody else? No! Yeah, send the township. No, don't touch me. You're an asshole. Stop leaving me alone. Stop. Do not kick me again. No, I'm not trying to kick you. You are trying to kick me. I stop it. To stop touching you. You don't know what I've gone through. Stop That's fighting. So no, you don't. Stop fighting with me. After apprehending the suspect, the male deputy radios the assisting officer to call for more backup. I'm good. Did you get her? No. <laughs> Yeah, I got her here by the main office. I don't want, I don't you want me to secure her in a car and help you? Yeah, if you can. No, I we're don't fine over here now. I don't want to be fine. Let's go over here. No, we're not voting. I'm, yo, I'm cooperating with you. No, you're not. Yes, I am. I told you from the get go to cooperate. Stop touching stuff. I'm not touching. Sh I'm not touching. Sh the f you're talking about. I'm not. You're hurting me. The Oh God, like, I don't even have shoes on. You're Tell stupid. Her. Her. You're dumb. You're stupid. You're stupid. Maybe hell. you should stop drinking. Don't push on me. Don't push on me. Give me a We're good. We're good. Okay. She's, she's trying to kick me. So. No, she just. I'm not trying to kick you. Yeah, her. If you want, just you can wait with her all until Tasha. Well, the one thing you will see uh, that I guess 
could be a good or bad thing. There's already a sergeant on site, you know, when things like this escalate and they have to either use the taser or use some type of a force, anything more than just voice. They say, get your sergeant. Looks like the sergeant's already there. So that kind of speeds it up, I think. We'll see how that go. Get your last quarter over. Okay. <laughs> They're drunk. I'm not. Yeah. Don't you? Oh, you're trying to manipulate me! Stop. In this situation! <laughs> you're an asshole! You're the, uh, you know, I'm not drunk! Uh, you're I trying to manipulate me in this situation! Take I a just, breath. I don't know why. You, Take a breath. I just want to shut the door. Okay. I told you you I can't, can't do shut that. The door, no, you but can't. This was gonna happen. You cannot hit a police if officer, was, miss. I didn't sh I didn't hit you. I shut you the door miss. in your face. And you spit at me, so stop. I, I because you shut the door, and I know my rights. Relax, stop I know, I know my rights. So when people actually say that, I know my rights. What does that mean? Just being honest, because I always hear that. I know my right. You can know the rights, but the police. You think you're going to beat them on the street? You versus them? Yes, you can. But they don't look like I see too many get away with it. So you're getting sued. Now I'm sitting on you because you're getting sued. So if you're getting sued, that gives me the permission to spit on you. Because you're, you're over here detaining me, right? Putting your hands on me, right? Because all I did was shut the door in your face. So therefore, you're... you're gonna get sued no so that's another issue all this talking and with this body camera she just admitted on camera that i spit on you so it's not when this goes to court later if it does they can't argue that because they got body camera evidence everything you say will and can be used against you as you can tell if she's sitting here telling you i closed the door on you i spit on you you just told on yourself fool in the name of being mad what's wrong with the tiktok uh Thing of 2024 these tiktok society of kids coming up teenage mom hmm, showing the police who's boss oh get oh. your hands off of me you yeah, don't have any warrant to restrain me get off of me <laughs> get off of me get off stop. of me i'm a stray Stop. Get off of me. Stop. Get off of me. Where's your chief of so police? I have to pick up my son. And you're over here. Get off of me. Do you have a spit mask? What? Get spit off mask. Of me. No. You're triggering me. Oh, you got one? Yeah. No, I'm not the fucking problem. I can't breathe. Because I can't breathe. Uh, just get a spit mask. Stop touching me. No, don't touch me. Don't touch me. <laughs> no, why? No, I'm not the dog. No, please, why are you just... That's fine. <laughs> just slide this over, and then we're going to take this other mask off. Okay? Relax your feet, and we're going to sit you up, okay? Sit your head up, miss. Come here. Roll over. There you go. Can we just roll on our side? Can here. We take the, uh, can we take that off? And Relax. Relax, okay? There you go. Do you want just, me to sign it? Just put it like, towards the back, just instead of right. All right, let's sit her up. Come here. You have another one under? Come here. Yeah. yeah she's you want to go back? Serious question. Does it take one, two, three, four, five officers to get this? 105 pound young lady. I mean, is the police is, are they starting to get that weak now? I mean, she's probably 105, 110 pounds, and it takes all these people to restrain her. Where is the training? And they should have sat her up a long time ago, really. But we'll see. Uh, Coleman's Coleman's there. Is he good? Where do you, do you want to is that start? better? Just walk over with Sean to her car. We had her sister. Where the hell is your mouth? Through your nose, after your mouth. Yeah, right here. Oh, so Ridley's gonna search you, okay? Do you have anything on you? You got it. No. Yep. Come on, we're gonna go to No, I was. I don't know who else is in the house. I'm just gonna I go check know. real quick. And no, sure I will put a restraining order on you. And I will fucking you. I will After placing the suspect in the vehicle, the male deputy enters the suspect's apartment to look for any additional clues as to why they were behaving erratically. The officers found no illegal paraphernalia, but saw open alcohol and lots of damaged items as if a fight had just occurred. The handcuffs were probably cranked because she was wailing on me, yeah. so. Yeah. And kicking the door. Okay. Um, you need an ambulance? You want to get that looked at? Doesn't hurt, right? 
Sorry. At least I'm not right now. That's good. <laughs> you want to yeah. stand up for a second? Do you, do you keep anything in your bra, like money or anything? Yes, but not at the moment. Okay. You go check, though. But... So, man, did you also notice that they were able to go in and search the apartment for any paraphernalia? You just gave them license to come in and do a full search to make sure there's nobody else in there. To make sure there's no other reason why they would be acting this erratically. Why were they acting like this? What do you think? Why did they want to go through all of this? This is just about them showing and proving that they're right. I can show you I'm right. You can't tell me nothing. I know everything. Is that the mentality we rolling with in 2025? Leave your comments below. Give this video a thumbs up. Give it a like. Give it a share if you care. I'll catch you on the next one. Cause this stuff's getting crazy, man. Crazy. I don't know what you've been doing. You've been sleep. Let me wake you up with something. Straight up. Yeah. Allow me to reintroduce myself. I'm Chris Monroe. R to the OE. I flip houses, rent cars, and make money. You know I'm not no motherfucker dummy. This how we.